Ah, welcome viewers to Let's Play Heroes of Might and Magic 2 with me, Bezlinir. This should be uh, episode 45, I believe. Uh, we are playing Roland's campaign, and we uh, I've decided to play Scenario uh, 7, The Gauntlet. I believe I've already read you the description, and I think I'm going to go with the Dragon Sword after having tried it out. I think that might help me. Uh, your reward from Scenario 7, uh, and this did confuse me, I had to look it up, uh, will actually be carried over to 10. It doesn't carry over to the next map. So, uh... You have just eight weeks to build your army and conquer a town on the other side of a distant river. There are three paths to take. Which will you choose? I think this map, unlike, uh... Unlike most maps, I believe... Well, I guess we'll find out if I'm wrong, but I believe that, uh, you... Well, that wasn't great. Uh, I don't believe you can lose after one week because you don't have a castle. Oh, yeah, I'm right, because, uh, that's how they covered that. You have a castle there, but you can't really do anything with it. I don't think you can build anything with it. Um, yeah, so it's not, it provides you an extra 250 or whatever the, it's a town, you get about 500 gold, but I think this guy has, um, Estates Basics, that gives you 100 gold, and you got, uh, Nomad Boots, which is unrelated to gold, but, uh, you're gonna be, it's gonna take you a couple weeks to get to where you need to go, so, oh, Logistics Advanced, that's gonna help. Uh, this is a training post. Not gonna need that yet. Um, let's see. Oh, gonna need this. It's a healthy tip from your friendly neighborhood. Uh, I'm not gonna bother with that mercury. I just feel like that'd be going out of my way. Just turn the page on that one. Go to day three. Not a whole lot of uh, stratagemizing to do. We'll pick up this gold, because why not? I think we may need that coal, but what do I know? Um, so we'll keep on keeping on. Turn the page. Not really anything to consider, like, with regards to any kind of, um... And I'm just picking the XP, because by the time we get where we're going, we're going to have plenty of gold. Uh, I don't need goblins, obviously. Get a little XP here. Ho ho ho, you say logistics expert. Movement is very valuable here. Um, gargoyles. Hopefully they won't fight me. Yeah, I'm not going to fight them. No reason to fight them if you don't have to. Rogues. Um, yeah, I should be able to dispatch these guys without losing any troops, I think. Keeping in mind that my druid would be able to... <laughs> I gotta do something about my troops. I, You know what? If you've been watching this whole series, you may have been uh, cringing at how bad I am about um, maneuvering my units. Uh, I was hoping for a 1 HK there. That's one hit kill. If I happen to encounter an enemy with a, a fast army, it will be good to have those druids up top so that mine... I don't, what does that make me immune to necromancing spells? That's I don't think that's going to make a difference. So, uh, let's move these druids up here. Um, other than that, this isn't too bad. What do I want? I want to, no, I want to have, um, oh, okay, okay. I think I want to have these guys up near those so they can protect them. These guys are flyers so they can swing anywhere I need them. Uh, get some more XP here. Uh, ballistics might be helpful, but not terribly important. Uh, I'm going the wrong way. Silly me. Um, How's my magic? I don't think I need any. Uh, 
You should be able to. Yeah, okay. I don't need any. Let's just keep on keeping on. Uh, it, it's a fair likelihood that we may hear that uh, we that dog barking may occur. So hopefully, <clears throat> ugh, as I gargle from. Um, oh, okay. As long as I don't have to fight for it. So I sh might be uh, testing my <laughs> setup as to hopefully it being capable of not having dog barking sounds coming through. How many are... Uh, oh, I hope we don't have to fight these guys. Okay, good. Hey, I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have said no if they wanted to join me, but uh, I don't know. What are you going to do hill for? I don't think I have anything... Uh, I can upgrade those pikemen, though, can't I? If that's what a hill fort is, it might be for my defense. Oh, they only upgrade specific troops. I think they upgrade all troops in future things. Temple. That's a good one, I think. I'm having trouble remembering what all the things are. Well, yeah, it raises morale. It's worthwhile. Uh, let's see. Uh, leadership expert. Let's advance. I think expert leadership would be more useful. Oh, lucky horseshoe. Don't mind if I do. There are a couple things that could affect your level of difficulty on this map. Uh, though I wouldn't rate this as a difficult map. Generally speaking, generally speaking, it's a bit of a gimme. Ugh. I'm a. Uh, Happen to be imbibing a Budweiser at the moment, so that's probably affecting my. Oh, genies! That's not the worst ever, but God, they might decimate my troops. I don't know if it matters, but looks like I first move. How fast are they? Very fast. No spells to speak of, do I? So what are they gonna do? They're probably gonna have my druids and I uh, could make it hard to take the town I eventually want to take. Uh, I don't like how good of a chance they have of having my troop stack. Two more chances to do it. Yep, half the enemy troop. That's a huge part of my army strength. Send him there. That should be able to get the job done. Maybe not. Well, that was a bummer. I do have a Barbarian Hero, which is, like, the worst, but that's the only fight, eh, uh, other than taking this castle. Okay, let's get there before, um, week three. This is where we want to be. And the main concern... Is gonna be see ah oh god I could have got an off a great hit on those this is gonna be a n way more annoying fight than I was hoping for it to be well we know what those guys are gonna do but I'm probably gonna get them with that so I should just get what I can out of these guys from the druids oh they're gonna go to my rangers now because they're my new were my new strongest true <clears throat> it doesn't matter though. Doesn't matter who survives this fight. Uh, oh, gosh dang it. But I actually had somebody defend that, though. Alright, well, let's go here. Hopefully, pixies I can get on the centaurs. Or not. Yeah, let's do it. Eh, it's worth the sacrifice. You're never gonna use those units again. Speaking of sacrifice, let's do another sacrifice. Uh, how many of these are left? 25? Or these guys. Well, let's get a first hit on these. And they can't retaliate, so. Uh, Griffins, I believe, um, have the ability, which is negated, although, by my sprites' ability. But they have the ability to. Um, da -da -da. Uh, counter attack all foes. Uh, well, I guess I can kill those guys near about. Okay, now my druids are a bigger threat, apparently. 
these Minotaur Kings are gonna get hidden on the pikemen. Doesn't matter. Or they're gonna get up there and kill the rest of my... I don't care. I don't care! You know what? It doesn't matter anymore. Uh, let's see. These guys are... Yeah, I got other flyers. Let's get these things. Clean hit on them. God, that morale is great. Oh, somebody said something about increasing my fight speed. Let's see if I can do that right now. If not, I'll do it after this battle. Speed. Very fast. Um, we'll see how that goes. I, I'm sorry I didn't increase the speed before. I've watched my own vids a couple of times, I'll admit, and, uh, yeah, they were, like, ridiculously slow, so, uh, sorry for that. Not really necessary, is it? Was that better? That should be better. No more eight-minute videos. Uh, I don't want diplomacy. No! I hate that thing. You know what all that does? Enemies that were gonna run from you, now you're gonna have to fight, unless you want to pay eight times what they're worth. You know? Unless you want to max diplomacy, in which case it might provide some benefit for you, maybe. Okay, let me think. Let me send it down. We got your town. Do, do, do. Let's go ahead and explore. And we're going to need this. Oh, wait. going to need that a lot. Um, and recruit... I do not need another Barbarian, thank you very much, but neither do I need... I'll go with the Barbarian. Why not? Uh, so, let's go get him some Gargoyles, and do some uh, exploring and picking up of things, like this. I think those Gargoyles should make him fast. What I understand of this whole deal is a little limited, but uh, not as fast as this guy with his, like, you know, logistics and whatnot, but hey. I'll uh, start picking up some mines. I'll come back to get some troops at the week's end. Ideally, I would like uh, my target monsters. Oh, God. Okay, yeah, I gotta end this. Hopefully, this will encode. So, uh, that's been it for this episode of Let's Play Heroes of Might and Magic 2 with me, Bezlinger, and I'll see you next time. This is me signing out. See you next time, viewer. Thanks for watching.